But one thing Sarasota is known for is its artistic culture and high-rises as well, but soon it might be known for farming. A new Holland dealership has opened up on the Sun Coast, and SN's Chris Eddie McClarty went to check it out. The story is, uh, a few years ago there was a new Holland dealer here in town, and they sold a lot of equipment. So there's a lot of equipment out here, but people can't get parts for them. They can't get them serviced because the new Holland dealer that was here closed up. Tractor owners are excited to have the local gem. They sell the product, they service the product, they have parts for the product. A lot of people that come in right now are seeing us from the interstate. When they see us from the interstate, they're going, holy mackerel. Holy mackerel because Sarasota is getting more of a reputation in the farming industry. We opened up to better serve the construction and agricultural sides both. Um, everybody in on the water as far as your landscapers and pretty much anybody involved at all in excavating or contracting of any kind. And then more into the east to your ranchers and farmers, down even to your small hobby farms and small equestrian places. When you're looking for the perfect tractor for you, you need to keep in mind a few key things. One that you're comfortable getting on, one that you're comfortable operating, but most importantly, we'll get the job done. Cab seat, open wraps, uh, different configurations of transmissions or drives, wheel size, speed. Hubert was a service manager for New Holland for 10 years. Now I'm a chaplain and the director of a seafarer center, but you know, they, you know the old saying, you can take the boy out of the country, but you can't take the country out of the boy. Hubert is currently fixing up a tractor as a hobby and says he may have big plans for the future. Oh, I don't know, maybe uh, buy a wagon and pull some people around on some hay rides and sing Kumbaya. Reporting for SNN in Sarasota, Chrissy McClarty, the Suncoast News Network. And if you want to know where it is, it's located right off of I-75 between exit 207 and 210.